Welcome to A Cup of Grace, brought to you today by the Home Grace here in Van Cleve, Mississippi. I'm Wayne Hudson. I'm an instructor and counselor here. I do relationship counseling here at the Home Grace, marriage counseling, and I'm with uh, Dr. Craig, Craig Carroll here today, and he's one of our counselors, and uh, I want to talk to Dr. Craig about um, what happens when a client graduates our program, they successfully complete our program, they return home, um, and how they're received and, and how the family back home should respond. Dr. Craig, would you address that, please? Uh, when the clients that we have graduate and they go back home, uh, of course, most of their families have experienced uh, them telling them things that weren't true but some of them for years that's kind of part of the package that, there, that's kind of part of the package you uh -huh. know and as a parent that had children mm -hmm. that recovered from addiction mm -hmm. by the grace of God uh, I can tell you that uh, a lot of the things that they will be facing are trust issues mm -hmm. their family has to learn to trust them again and, and we try to make sure that as the guys return home to their families, they understand that this is going to be there. Mm -hmm. That it's uh, something that is, uh, as you said before, it's part of the package with addiction. Mm -hmm. uh, stealing, lying, these are some of the things that the families have had to deal with in the past. And it's hard to get past the blame factor mm -hmm. and it's hard to get past or over to the families that continually bombarding them with the guilt is not going to help them grow uh, if we are Christians and we believe in God's forgiveness he said he separates our Sins as far as the east is from the west. That's a long way. Isn't That's it? a long way, <laughs> but we're human. Uh huh. We don't have that same capability of God. God chooses not to remember our sins, uh -huh. and uh, getting the family to remember that that part of the healing is going to be dealing with forgiveness. As a matter of fact, that's that's a major factor. It's a factor in the life of the. Uh, person that has been addicted uh, when they uh, receive the forgiveness from Christ is actually accepting that forgiveness. Mm -hmm. That guilt wants to play over and over and over and that they're not worthy to be forgiven. But the truth is none of us are worthy to be forgiven but right. Christ uh, doesn't put that limitation on us. Mm -hmm. He doesn't say that we can't be forgiven. He says to accept him accept his love and his mercy. Thank the Lord. Amen. For me. <laughs> but, uh, and it's hard for families to get past that point. Mm -hmm. And uh, being aware of the fact that uh, when, a, when, a, when a client graduates and he goes back home, that he is going to have to deal with this. And, and he needs to be able to live in a manner that uh, eliminates the mistrust as much as possible. Mm -hmm. In other words, when he's late coming home for something, Go ahead and say, this is the reason I was late because that's going to be clicking in the, the, the back of his spouse or his family's mind is uh, where's he been? What's he been doing? Mm -hmm. You know, And getting to a point, and it will get to a point, if, uh, if they are responsible and they step forward, step up responsibility, responsibly, mm -hmm. it will come to a point where the family will Hopefully. But initially, you know would you advise them, the family, to trust but verify? Trust right. but verify. That That's a good phrase to use. Uh -huh. Trust but verify. Uh -huh. And also for, for the one returning home to be overly uh, okay. responsible. Yeah. Uh -huh. and, uh, and most of our guys understand this, you know. They, they they know where they've been, mm -hmm. you know, better than we do. 
and they know what their family relationships is. And but we see God mending this uh, brokenness in the family, mm -hmm. and uh, consistently we see families come back together and unified mm -hmm. in that love that God gives. Them. Yeah, that's uh, healing that's brought by uh, Christ interacting in their lives. Christ is ultimately the one that is the great healer anyway. Amen. I want to thank you so much thank for you. being with us again. This has uh, been very informative and I'm sure our people back home have uh, enjoyed their time with Dr. Craig Carroll at the Home Grace.